Hi, it's Dee with Mobile Home Flipper. What are some ways in which you find deals? Well, let's talk about it. More and more, you are going to be start hearing about people just walking away from mortgages and homes that they had put down payments into. And the simple reason is they just can't afford it and they just need to be out. This is one of those scenarios. It was a referral from one of the park managers that we have a rapport with. They told us that the individual had already decided they were moving out of state, already had their plans in place, already a, an arrangement with the private party lien holder that they're making payments to, to just turn the title back over to them. They said if we end up coming in, maybe offering them a little bit of money, that they might be willing to work with us, that we can end up paying that loan off and be able to acquire this home that does not need much work at all. I think our budget on this is $2,500. And then we have a nice margin for resale. So we picked this home up for pretty dang cheap. It was the payoff plus a couple thousand to the seller. Within a less than a week, they had accepted our offer. We'd paid off the underlying lien. And they were out and had left it broom swept clean. That was part of the deal. <laughs> and basically ready for us to come in and start doing work on the home. So we've just have some touch-ups. We've got, you know, paint that we're going to be taking care of in this room and fixing a broken door over there. And we have some touch-ups and clean up things, modernizing that we're going to do, such as, you know, light fixtures and retacking up that uh, exhaust fan. We're going to be painting cabinets just to freshen, brighten it up, make it more modern. But we're not going to have to do the cop top or the floor here because it's in good shape. Um, that color that we're going to paint those cabinets will end up going really nice, but it'll update it so that you don't have the oak. A lot of people today aren't super fit, big fans of oak. In some markets, in other markets they're not. In my market they're not. They consider it dated. Um, the carpets, probably just going to be cleaned. These cabinets will be painted inside out. Light fixtures. We have some laundry valves that we need to take care of that are leaking. Checking the HVAC, those typical things. You know, as you can see, this home is pretty dang clean. Within a week, we'll have it all cleaned up and ready to go back on the market. It's a great little supplement project for us in between some of our more aggressive rehabs. It's going to put money back into our pocket pretty quickly. On average, these homes that we call quick turns, we can get in and out of them and sold typically within a month. We make pretty decent money on those and that helps to cover some of our business operating expenses and or in some cases could end up helping with uh, rehab costs on some of our more aggressive rehabs and or just put profit in our pocket so we can keep on buying more homes because it multiplies. So another great way in which to be able to come across properties is you know, talking to the managers, looking for those types of opportunities, being in the right place, right time, having a good relationship with them, rapport with them, reputation with them, that they can trust you to clean it up the way that they want it. She's got specific things she wants done on the outside. In fact, the vast majority of her budget is outside so that she's happy with the uh, way it looks. And that's the reason why she gave us the lead, because she loves the kind of work that we do and the way that we end up making it the way she wants it, cleaning it up appropriately and making it a good, nice home for somebody to move into within her community. And hopefully they're going to stay there a long time. Uh, so, you know, big thing coming up within an economic downturn is a lot of people are going to start walking away. We have a finance company that we own and we have consistently probably... Every month have had about two repos that we've taken back where people have literally just said, I can't do it. Here's the keys. I am out. I'm done. Goodbye. I don't care if I lose money on what I put down or the money I've put into it or the money I've paid in interest. I just need to be done. I need to stop the bleeding. And in an economic downturn, you are going to find a heck of a lot more opportunities like that. Even if the person owns the home outright, if the lot rent starts becoming too expensive, if the taxes become too expensive, if the utilities become too expensive, if they have not overtime anymore, it becomes too expensive. If they have a loss of income, it becomes too expensive. So in a lot of cases within a downturning market, there's going to be a lot more opportunities like this that are going to come up. And it's a distressed situation, but it's not a distressed home. And so there's a lot of different variations of distress that you are going to come across not only in regular real estate, but also in the mobile home industry 
that you can, we're not taking advantage because she was planning on taking, just taking a loss and just handing it back to the other guy. So we're not taking advantage. We're actually giving them some money to be able to move on and get a good start with their life when they weren't expecting to have that. And they were thrilled to have worked with us in that capacity and how quickly we were able to operate with getting them cash so that they could end up leaving within the time frame that they want it to be due to work and school and life. So if you want to learn more about some of the strategies, techniques that we use in our business over the last 20 years, and currently within many of our markets currently for marketing, to be able to find leads, building rapport, being able to negotiate deals, beyond different types of deals that you can do to be able to continue to generate income while you're doing some of your more uh, aggressive rehabs, feel free to click that link below. We have some great information on the other side of there that will introduce you into our business model, how we do it, uh, some of the benefits of working with us and our 20 years of experience. We are uh, experienced nationwide, even though our home markets are Idaho and Utah. Primarily, we have worked nationwide in a various different markets throughout the country, micro markets, suburban markets, rural markets, city markets, tons of different situations, whether it's a park related situation or whether it's individual homes. And we'd love to be able to, to hear from you. Uh, please click that link below. Let us know who you are, that you're interested in looking to learn more about mobile home investing and looking at this as another opportunity for you to be able to alleviate financial stress from yourself. We are recession proof. That is our industry. Uh, when people are losing houses, they're also losing mobile homes, but the mobile homes that are being lost are typically going to displace people to other areas. And typically the people losing houses are going to typically be looking to move into mobile homes. And in some cases we're starting to see cash offers because people are just looking to get out of their more expensive homes due to taxes, insurance, and all the other costs that are associated with it, uh, their site built homes, and looking to put them down on and or purchase outright mobile homes. So there is a, a shift that has taken place in a lot of different markets, specifically ours is one, and there's gonna be various different opportunities depending on which side of the fence you take a look at, and we'd love to help educate you as to how to maximize and benefit from that and have a win-win for all parties involved.